Okay, this one is just going to be a quick one. Um, ALH TDI complained about uh, hard brake pedal intermittently. Um, so somebody put clamps on here to because the tubes were cracked. Um, pedal seemed to be better, but ever since this was repaired, uh, EGR fault code um, didn't didn't have a specific one in terms of low flow, just deviation, EGR deviation. When going to measuring box, 003, um, even though EGR was activated at 70%, um, mass airflow was 500 milligrams per stroke, which was higher than specified. Um, so what we did was, or what I did, uh, replace this hose because it's still stuck in air here and that decreases the amount of vacuum going to the EGR. So now with this replaced, these match. And if I go into um, basic setting, EGR is on, so that's low. EGR is gonna go off. You'll see this go to zero, and then that comes high. 576. So EGR is off right now. It's gonna come back on and this is going to come back down. So a vacuum leak solved the EGR problem. Not the, not the leak, but fixing the vacuum leak solved the EGR problem.